<sighs> you know, you didn't have to take me to the pool today. I was camped with just being at home. Well, if you insist, then I guess we can just hang out by the pool today. Even though I had plans to stay at home, but for you, darling, I'll do anything. So, what do you want to do today? Well, besides go in the pool and everything. Sun bathe? I don't recall. Oh, suntan. I see. Well, I mean, of course we can suntan. But I'm just not sure if my skin will like that. All oh, right, I forgot. We can just wear sun lotion, sunscreen. <laughs> it appears so, I did call it sun lotion. <laughs> well, why don't we just lay down for a little bit? and just enjoy the sounds of the beach and whatnot. Does that sound good to you? Great. Sounds good to me. Did you bring some water? I am getting quite thirsty. Thank you. I need that. Thank you, darling. So, you were telling me something about Mirio and Deku. Um, what was that again? All oh, right, Mirio came back from his long-term mission. It took him quite a lot of months, actually. Well, luckily, he didn't come out with any injuries or anything as well. You did catch up with him, correct? You and him are quite close, if I remember. Mm -hmm. All right, well, at least that's good. And what about the news about Deku? Oh, you found where he is. That's interesting. Is he okay? Oh, he texted you back. After how long, though? A few months. Well, I mean, that is when he usually got missing. I say as I put quotation marks. Because I don't think he went missing on accident. I think he did it on purpose. I don't know, but something inside of me is saying that. Maybe he really doesn't want to become a hero. But not a villain. No, obviously not. It's not like Deku to be villainous at all. I, when I look at Deku, all I see is hero potential. And the soul to become a true hero. But he wants to make his own story. Even though this is real life and not a fairy tale, he wants to make up his own story. Make up his own hero. Well, you could say 
he could be a vigilante now. But since he doesn't want anyone to visit him, nor even get in contact with him, you are only the real way of getting into contact with Deku now. So you're going to be on hand to hand with more pro heroes. Looking more into like a uh, search mission than anything. Maybe even, I don't know. Wait, darling, I have an idea. Don't you have a few friends in the UA Academy that have like invisibility quirks and whatnot? All right. Well, if you're really up for it, you could maybe take a phone recording of you and Deku having a conversation or even bring like one or two of your invisible friends and they could record you and Deku to make sure that he's okay and not and see what he looks like after these few months of just being on his own. I mean, there was news reports of a masked hero and whatnot prowling through the towns and cities, saving people. I don't know if that's Deku or not, but if we get video proof that it is, then we might be onto something. And we might be able to get bring Deku back. It's worth a shot. <laughs> All right. Well, see if you can hang out with him or see him in the next days or so. See what you can do. But for now, let's head back and do some sunbathing, like you called it. <laughs> It is a really hot day out today, isn't it? Luckily, the water seems pretty cold. Mm hmm. Well, of course, I plan on swimming. Just not right now. Maybe in a little bit. What's that? Oh. <laughs> I guess, um, me and my father are not really on the best of talking terms right now, but I can see he's trying. He's trying to become one of the best heroes out there. Even though being the number one hero, it's a lot to handle on his shoulders, but he's trying his best. And I could see that. And yes, I can see that I'm being more harsh on him for abandoning his family and whatnot. But I can tell he's trying to turn a new leaf. And I can at least respect that. You could say I see a little bit more of a man than a mouse now. Mm -hmm. But, um, nonetheless, <sighs> are you ready to go swimming now? All right. But first, wait, why do you look scared? Is there something you're not telling me? Oh, I see. Well, I can help you with that, actually. Mm-hmm. I, 
can teach you a few things to keep you afloat. And maybe even help you swim a little bit better. <laughs> of course, darling. Anything for you. Now come on, take my hand. I'll teach you a few things while we get into the water. <laughs> I love you too, darling. Now come on. <laughs> 